Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Katherine Herr. And I'm Brian Dorman. Today, the California Department of Water Resources measured the state's snowpack for the month of April. They've determined that this snowpack is one of the largest ever recorded. And now the Fresno Irrigation District says this water year will go down as the biggest water year in modern history. CBS 47's Esteban Reynoso joining us now live on Shaw Avenue near Kerman with a story for us this evening. Esteban. Brian and Catherine, some of that overflow from the San Joaquin River, it ends up right behind me in these reserve water basins, and then it goes to farmland, but it all starts in the mountains after that snow melts, but some water officials are saying that it could cause some problems in the summer months. It's looking like this year's statewide snowpack will probably most likely be either the first or second biggest snowpack on record. After one of the wettest starts to any year on record for California, it's not hard to grasp that right now there's nearly two and a half times the average snowpack in the central Sierra. 17. The South Sierra stands at 300% of normal and the Northern Sierra is at 192% of the usual April average. That's important because the April total is how state and federal agencies plan their water allocations. And for Fresno's canals and waterways, it is going to be the biggest water year on record. What I've seen, I think, in this neck of the woods and further south, I think it is the wettest year on record. Bill Stretch is the general manager with Fresno's Irrigation District. He knows just how mind-boggling the record snowpack reading really is. Just wait over the next three months when that when the snow starts melting. We're hoping for a very cool spring. The recharged basins will do probably will probably set a record this year in the Fresno area, uh, which is great. But what isn't great is if things get hot and the snow starts a rapid melt. We are nervous. Water flow could be too much for the system to handle. That snowpack, you know, as it starts to uh, warm up here, when we have these really big, unprecedented uh, years like this, we can't handle, the system is not designed to handle this amount of uh, precipitation and, and snow. As the sun breaks through, more of that water will end up down here, and that means that more farmers could use it to hopefully take some of the load off of these canals. Now, Stretch says that the irrigation year could go all the way until October. Live in Fresno County, Esteban Reno, so CBS 47 Eyewitness News.